Girls wrestling is one of the fastest growing high school sports in the country. And in this week's Focusing on the Future, Bucks County's wrestlers are making history in the male dominated, dominated sport. CBS News Philadelphia's Wakisha Bailey sits down with a couple of high school title holders. I'm just like aggressive. I'm in my zone. It's just me and my opponent. Weighing in at 106, Conwell Egan sophomore Julia Horger is making history on the mat. There's a single leg transfer. Tiny blonde hair. No one really expects <laughs> you to be a wrestler. Horger was the first Bucks County female to win a gold medal at the Pennsylvania Interscholastic Athletic Association State Tournament at the Giant Center in Hershey. She also finished out her season undefeated. It felt so exciting. I was really proud of myself and everyone out there cheering and all my supporters. I was really proud. This young champion has been wrestling since she was seven years old. Back then, there were not many girl wrestlers. My brother always used to wrestle and I would always see them wrestling. Instead of sitting at practice drawing, I wanted to get in with them and wrestle. I used to be the only girl in practice all the time. And now when I go to practice, I see like a bunch of different girls I can talk to and wrestle with. And it's just really amazing to see how many girls are getting into it. Like silver medalist Grace Nesbitt, this Neshaminy High School sophomore is known to pin her opponents in the first round. This year I was known for the bar, like an arm bar on the top. Mm -hmm. And that's how I like won most of my matches, five pins. So when I step on the line, it's like wartime. Nesbitt's father introduced her to the sport. Since then, she's been hooked. At first, like he was pushing me to do it because he, he, that's what he did. So he wanted me to join, but I didn't really want to join in the beginning because it was one of the hardest sports you could ever do. These trailblazers are ready for more young women to join the ranks. For me, it's like, it's like my favorite sport. Go for what you want. Well, Keisha Bailey, CBS News, Philadelphia.